Hola familia, my name is Ray Olmedo and today I'm going to be sharing with you um, a Devo that is being inspired by recent events and uh, sweet memories and uh, the first of which is um, I was encouraged to read through the book of Psalms uh, all these past days like you know since last week so as I've been reading in the book of Psalms, um, you know, how David used songs and worship and prayer to uplift his spirit or to communicate with God. It's, it's been really, it's been revealing, let's put it that way. So I looked a little bit into what the, the book of Psalms was, and it says that their words accompanying the music or prayers in form of songs. I was also encouraged to worship this past week. And um, also, um, I just happened to um, be in this Mexico trip that, you know, the mission trip that we did, and Brandy was there. And Brandy is really singing all day. Uh, no kidding when she said that she connected words and, and, and things that happened to songs. And so that was really uplifting, you know, she was singing all the way there, all the way back. And it was just sweet. So this song came to mind and it's a song that I haven't heard for a while, but every time that I listen to it, it just really lift me up. And it's called My Lighthouse from uh, Rand Collective. And um, it's a really nice beat, energetic song. So not only the words are very uplifting, but also uh, the music is. So Gage is being nice enough to link it, uh, or to he will link it to my Devo so you guys can listen to it. And the lyrics to this song are incredible. And I'm really, it, it, you know, this song came this week where I really needed something like this and um, and also, it's a special song because it reminds me of someone that we probably all of you knew and loved, which is Chris Culver, which for the ones that you, the ones of you that don't know him, he used to be the leader of the worship team for a season in our church. And this was like a song that he used to play all the time and he used to sing. So. Uh, always make me think of him so let's say what is this let's see what is this song all about so the first uh, lyrics of the song said in my wrestling and in my doubts in my failures you won't walk out you great, your great love will lead me through you are the peace in my troubled sea in the silence you won't let go, in the questions your truth will hold. Your great love will lead me through, you are the peace in my troubled sea. So the, cor the chorus goes to say, my lighthouse, my lighthouse, shining in the darkness, I will follow you. I will trust the promise and you will carry me safe to shore. So I really, really, love this song it really encouraged my heart these these few days these past few days and also reminds me of the promises that we have in a scripture um, even though if we have we know that god is our lighthouse that he will lead us through his promises safe through uh, to shore we know that that doesn't mean that those waters that we're navigating in will come right away Right, we, we do know, we do have the promise of the peace that He gives us that surpasses all understandings that we can only achieve through prayer, supplication, and thanksgiving. And, uh, but just to know that, you know, even if you're in the middle of this darkness and in the middle of this like trouble sea, you will see that light up in the hill that will lead you, will lead you safe to shore. It's just so uplifting. Um, this scripture I found, 1 John 1, 5. And the Bible tells us that God is our light and in Him there is no darkness at all. Also, Psalm 27, 1. It's a Psalm of David. 
and he says, the Lord is my light and my salvation. So why should I be afraid? The Lord is my fortress protecting me from danger. So I ask myself, am I allowing God to act as my lighthouse in my life? Are you? Are you trusting him to be that beacon of light, that guidance that the light of a lighthouse provides to, to just bring you sa to safety? And if not, I'm gonna encourage you as I've been encouraged through this song and through many people I learned about in, in this Devo that uh, a lighthouse needs a light keeper. So I have those light keepers that are keeping that light shining on me, uh, making sure that I will be stable and just navigating those waters and uh, trusting that the Lord will lead me safe to shore. So I thought it was such a sweet song to share in this season. And um, I just pray that it will talk to you the same way that it has been talking to me and just really bringing peace to my heart. So church family, uh, probably next time when we see each other, it's going to be January 2023. For now, I'm going to tell you Merry Christmas, Feliz Navidad for you, Ari. Uh, jo Noel or something like that in French. Um, I just pray that you, uh, you all will be uh, safe and sound and grounded in, in His Word. So let me close in prayer. Lord Jesus, I thank you for your Word, Lord, for, for you being the beacon of light in our, in our hearts, Lord, in our lives. I pray that you will always lead us, Lord, safe to shore and that you will open our eyes so we can see that light that protect us and keep us safe. And it's in Jesus' name that I pray. Amen. Thank you.